Hey, howdy, y'all. Welcome to Fool from 4966. I just kind of thought I'd give you a little show of uh, here in Tennessee, USA, Chattanooga area, what the end of winter looks like. And you're probably wondering how I know it's the end of winter. You got to look around and let the plants tell you. The plants are starting to bud. That means spring's coming. The well, the trees are at least. But I thought I'd give you a little, little show. I don't know show and tell. I guess I'm telling now. <laughs> but anyways, um, let's see if I can find this. Neighbor city. Shit, I threw it back here. Let's see. He's on the open hook. It is back here. Okay. Oh, shoot. Well, I tell you what. I got food, so I'm not going out for food. Um, I guess I'm going to go get cigarettes. I know, they're not good for me, folks. I know it, you know it. It's just a matter of shedding the addiction, I guess. Matter of fact, I'm smoking one while I'm talking to y'all. Um, let's take some out. I'll get out of there. Sorry. If you hear me out of breath, it's because, oh, yeah, I smoke. <laughs> Anyways. Um, I'm not sure what the topic is. i just shown you the drive again, but in the winter, I think the last time I did this was uh, in the summertime, I think, or... I'm not positive. Might have been a year ago. I don't know. Well, damn near to it, man. Um, I'm going to be leaving this place soon. I'm tempted to put in my 30, 60 day notice. Um, it all depends on it all depends on somebody if they pay me back because I want to get out of here folks man you, you would feel the same way if your heart if your heart and your soul was in the Philippines you know yeah I know it can't be exactly the same as when I was there because I was visiting, well, visiting for two and a half months, uh, that's a good visit, I think, but in the USA, I'm not allowed to have a wife because I'm not rich enough, which is, it's time, man, it's time to shed the shackles and pick freedom, pick two, true freedom. But it's about how's it free over there when there's a dictator? Mm -hmm. Wouldn't the Philippines get a dictator? You know, it's all it's all BS and people wanna people wanna curb you from being happy because they're not happy. Well, they could stay unhappy. I'm gonna go be happy. Matter of fact, I got a cough in front of me, but I don't care. I don't have no worries. No worries. But, um, this is the drive, pretty much. Um, I don't know if you're all bored of it, but there's a lot of people that comment and say, man, you need to show more of that. They find it beautiful. Ooh. 
Fucking cop stops everybody. Sorry. Here in America, man. Part of the problem are the, are the cops. Because they got control, man. So they think they do. Well, they do. They got the power to arrest you. <coughs> take away your freedom but um that's another story probably another video which I know I say that I'm gonna do another video on that subject yeah sometimes it's not important and I don't do it uh don't like to bring negativity but uh just gotta learn that sometimes people are gonna piss you off whether they're authoritarian or non-authoritarian and you just gotta deal with it that's what I'm doing today see look at that shit and I say baby because I mean my wife uh, she watches these things she's pretty proud she was pretty proud man she was like Hold on, move out of the way. My husband, he's a vlogger. He does YouTube. <laughs> he's a YouTuber. Yeah, that's what she said. YouTuber. But uh, that's where we're looking at. And that's me in the door, if you can see it. And my Toyota. It's been a good little car. I mean. <clears throat> I definitely can't complain. I've had this thing, what, nine years? Something like that. And uh, she purrs like a kitten still. Anyways, folks, I'm going to go ahead and go in the store. I'll let you go. And uh, and uh, those are my thoughts on the drive. Um, with a little bit of interruption of a police officer. I don't know his name. I don't, I don't know if it's a he or she, but... Four cars ahead of me just got to slam on the brakes. Everybody's afraid to hit a cop. Anyways, they put their pants on the same way as all of us, man. One leg at a time. But, uh, <clears throat> like I said, we're not going to get into that. And I'll, I'll talk to you all later, man. I love you. And uh, like, share, subscribe. Love you. Bye.